I don't have to be there. So, you know, same situation from the scripture, whole scripture that we believe, and I think it's the same root with the Middle East religion, Jewish, Christian, Muslim, and the similar. Because for me, it's an important issue. Because for me, yeah, yeah, yeah. as I said to you, you cannot have your cake and eat it, right? So if, if you, you agree with me that this seems contradictory, okay. to claim... How much, how much you believe that the God is almighty, that he can do anything? Sorry? So you don't believe I that believe that Allah does what He wishes, what, what, is in, what befits His majesty, yeah. and what is in accordance to His attributes. So Allah is all-powerful. For example, Allah is just. He doesn't do injustice to people. Okay? So that's one thing Allah doesn't do, right? Allah doesn't do injustice to His creation. Allah doesn't become ignorant. It's not one day Allah knows the creation, what they're doing, the next day He doesn't know what they're doing, you know? That's not our perspective of God, right? So to us, Allah is perfect. So I cannot say Allah is within the creation and at the same time Allah is entering the creation because it's a contradiction. Jesus is not, Jesus is not in uh, Christian theology, Jesus is not within the creation. He became a creation. He became a man. So, so God became the creation. He, yes, of course. Okay, God became the creation. But you're saying to me from the beginning, God is the creation. Yes. Okay, so if you are already a doctor, you cannot become a doctor. Who said that? I'm saying that. <laughs> How are you going to become a doctor? I mean, so you are a human being, you can still maybe become a human being. Yeah. Maybe because the core of the Christianity is in the context. I'm asking you. Human being yes. is different from God. No, no, we're talking about the principle. Yeah, that if you're is already, logic. No, yeah, that is, we use the yes, logic. We are human beings, you have to use a reasoning. How are we going to discuss okay. otherwise, yeah? But if you're handling with them, how can you, how can you say that Allah is, Allah is uh, transcendent? Mm -hmm. So it cannot be what everyone. I don't use the word cannot for, for God. I don't use I I don't believe it is respectful to use the word cannot for God. To say God cannot do X, Y, and Z. Yeah. On the other hand, I say Allah does not do X, Y. Okay. So there's a difference between the two. But he still can can if he wants. I don't use this terminology. I say Allah's attributes. Look, for me, I wouldn't say Allah does or doesn't, except if Allah tells me he does or he doesn't. Simple as that. I don't speak on behalf of God. I'm not the secretary of God to speak on behalf of God, right? No, of so I wait. Not, uh, I yes. also not speak, uh, speak in behalf of Jesus. So, so, from what I believe, mm -hmm. from what I thought, and what I fit in, that Jesus mm -hmm. has become God himself, has become the human flesh, flesh and blood. But he's already human, you said. He's already in the creation. God. So God is if God is in the creation. He's already in the, the human. So he's already a human. It's the spirit of God. The spirit of God was so, the, was in the creation. So is the spirit is the spirit of it's God? In you. It's in me. No. Is the spirit so is the spirit of God God so or not God? Is God? The spirit is God. The spirit is it God? The spirit of God. How we know God? No, you know, you guys say the the Christians believe okay. that God is a spirit. So when you say the spirit of God is there, you're saying God is there. There's no difference, right? Yeah. Yeah, so if God was already there, how did he become again where he's already he is? Become anything he wants. Like for example, you're saying God is all powerful yeah. and then God became more powerful. Well God is already all powerful. How does he become more powerful again? He's limitless. Sorry? His power is limitless, you know? But he's already all powerful. Yeah. It is by our our measurements. So according, yes. according to your analogy. So don't you do you do you see the contradiction that I'm yeah. facing, you know? Yeah. Do you see yeah. because uh, I, uh, we are rational we're rational human beings. Uh, I think she sees the contradiction I see, you know. Maybe you don't see. Maybe she understands the point I'm trying to make. Maybe she understands. You understand the point I'm saying. You understand the point I'm making. She doesn't agree with me. She, she doesn't agree with me, but she understands the point I'm trying to make. I'm not saying she's on my side now. I'm not. <laughs> so I think they have. You need to discuss this. You need to discuss this among themselves. No, 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 no. Okay. I have a language barrier for this. Oh no problem. It's okay. It's okay. According to your analogy, you say the God can do everything whatever he wants right so if I ask you that if God can God chose to be not in existent he's already asked that question by the way he's already yeah. asked that question not? not by me he's asked that question by Mansoor and he he says why not and to me look I'm I come from a different perspective yeah. some Muslims here will come and say to you God cannot do X I don't agree with this terminology Allah as the says in the Quran he's capable to do anything he wants to do Okay. okay, he's capable. He has cap capacity over everything. Allah has capacity over everything. In Allah, ala kulli shayin khadir. Allah has capacity, capability over everything. But he does what befits his majesty. The queen can do a lot of evil things, but she has a level of, of highness that she wouldn't do specific things. For example, for example, she wouldn't shake hands. Just a point I'm trying to make. The queen in this country, 
according to my knowledge, doesn't shake hands with anyone. There are a group of people that she shakes hands with, right? Doesn't mean that she cannot shake hands with other people, but she believes that Her Majesty or Her Highness, she doesn't just shake hands with anyone. Allah, who has the highest of example, can do a lot of things, right? That doesn't mean Allah does them because they do not befit His Majesty. As I said to you, for example, Allah said that He made injustice prohibited upon Himself. He prohibited it upon himself. He doesn't do injustice in, to anyone, right? But my, let's go to a different point because we talked about contradiction as, uh, already. I think we went in a circle when it comes to the contradiction. Let's ask a different question, you know? You guys are Christian, right? Yeah. So uh, why do you believe Christianity is true? Yeah, I think maybe one thing that we haven't talked about is the core of Christianity is in the concept of salvation. No, but what do you, why yeah. do you believe the idea of Christianity is true? Because look, Christianity has an idea of salvation, correct? Yeah. Why do you believe the scripture and the religion itself is true so we can accept this idea of salvation or not? Same like what is the reason? The same like Muslim believe in Quran is true. But do you know what I believe has nothing to do with what you believe? Yeah. So, so for example, no, no, no. just I, I, we, we if you just allow me, just just allow me to, to, to just finish what I'm trying to say, you know? If, if I'm a Christian, if I'm an atheist, a Christian, a Hindu, a deist, it's not going to change the fact that you're a Christian. So I'm asking you, what, leave me now outside, I, I'm irrelevant, right? I'm asking, why are you a Christian? The same. I cannot explain, but faith. So your faith, because faith is why you're Christian? Uh, the same faith hmm. that make you believe the Quran. That is what I have. How do you know why I believe in the Quran? You didn't ask me. I would ask you, you didn't ask me. No, no. <laughs> you, said that, you said that you are Muslim. Then Did I say I'm Muslim because of faith? No. But then that's what, what you said. Believe? Then what you believe? It's that you're Muslim and not believe. I'm a Muslim. I'm a Muslim. I do not just base my my uh, so you're my acceptance and you're not of Islam. In Quran. Right? I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying to say. I'm trying to say why, why I believe. Way. If you want to talk to them, I can go here. Because no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm trying to have a discussion no, no. with them. Let yeah, me ask okay. it another way. If anyone yes. who is who doesn't know you, right, and you don't know him, and he you don't know his identity, whether he is Christian, Muslim, or Jewish, any other thing. He's asking you why you choose to be a Christian. What well, will be your response? That is my faith. Okay, so that's the answer, yeah? Yeah, that's my answer. What about you? How can you explain your faith? Can you well, I'll, no, we'll come me, to that. I'll, come, I'll tell that. you, I'll tell you. Don't worry, I'm happy to tell you. You want to ask him now? If you ask him, I don't mind. I'll give him the mic and you can ask him, you know? I think the yes. question that you need to ask from us, uh, yes. to us, is yes. where does this faith coming from? come from? You to know? me? No. Uh, can I, I tell you why I wouldn't I, ask that? Like, like my husband and also I, we have faith, mm -hmm. but our faith is not something that coming out of the blue, of course. Mm -hmm. Because we are taught in Christian tradition, because we heard knowledge something that we made that made us believe mm -hmm. that Jesus is the God so uh, can so I tell you why can I tell you why I'm not asking that question faith came from sight okay. also came from Insights. hearings also came experience. from experience okay excellent also coming also coming from reverence I agree with all of, of that course. I agree with all of that can I can I tell you but why even though Okay. Many people have the same experience, yes. even though we heard the same thing, even okay. though we see the same thing. Okay. It doesn't guarantee that we believe or we put our trust Excellent. in the same. So our experience is different, yeah. God. Even though we have or share the same experience, sure. mm -hmm. so that's what we are trying to say. That even though we share the same experience, we may have different different results. Faith. Okay, sure. But because, can I can yeah. I tell you why I'm not asking you why do you have your faith? Because mm -hmm. to me. As you, what you rightly just said, we have different experiences. Our experiences can lead to different resources. But your experience does not guarantee you reach truth. So if I go to a Hindu, he will say the same thing that you just said. I have faith that Hinduism is true. My experience is the reason I believe in Hinduism. I go to a Sikh, Sikhism is that. So how can I find the truth then? When God created us, he placed in this reality one truth, right? He did not place many ways to reach the Creator. Christians don't believe there's many ways to God. Muslims don't believe you believe there's one way, right? One way in John, John 14, 6 that Christians quote all the time. Yeah, yeah. I'm the way, the truth and the life. Yeah, there's one way, right? So in Islam, there is one way too. We believe there is one way. My question is, how do I know the way? If your answer is, is just faith, then it's not really an answer because if I go to a, a Hindu, he will say the same thing to me. To an atheist, he will have faith in science today. People have faith in everything today. You know, they believe science will make them do anything. That's the good thing. That's you, you, the think, you think, you think, you think, you think it's good for a Hindu 
to believe other than the, than Christ. Yes. No problems. Why? Is it good? No, it's good. It's good. It's good. So it's good to deny Jesus yeah. as your because Lord and I Savior. Don't think that Christians want to force all people. No, to nor, do we. In nor do we. Nor do we. Nor do we. believe that God is existing. No, sure. No, no, no. But no? there is a there difference. Is no force. Sure. Yeah. Se seeking the so truth. Okay. No, seeking the truth and forcing are two separate <laughs> things. Who, who is here trying to force anything on anyone? We're having a rational discussion as human beings, yeah, right? Definitely. So no one has brought forcing into yeah. the idea. Yeah. But if you seek the truth, you have to engage with other people. You have to disagree yeah. with them, right? So I wouldn't agree with everything you have to offer. So my question still stands. Mm. How do you find out the truth? Mm. Because you, you just said, by the way, just to say what you said, you said it's good not to believe in Jesus as your Lord and Savior. As a Christian, and maybe you can talk to Christians about this idea, we wouldn't say it's good not to believe in Allah or to pro or Prophet Muhammad. We say that's bad. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's not. It's you not. It's uh, not that. Conclusion from what you say. What she say? No, I asked her. She said yes. Yeah. No, no, no. But I, I didn't mean, conclusion. Yeah. I just asked her, I and mean, she said yes. It's good. I How mean, is the conclusion? She I mean, said yes. Because you said that. You said that. It's good that everyone has their own faith yeah. and belief. Yeah. Okay. Yes. I'm not, not saying. Can, who good. can I listen to just because I'm just? I'll try. I'll try to answer. Who should I answer? You know. Yes. But I'm one person. I'm not two. You know. I have to. Yeah. Listen. Yes, oh, I'll learn listen, no problem, no problem. You make yes. a conclusion and just cut off what she said. Okay. She said it's good yes. for everybody have their own belief. Yes. Not yes. just Christian. Okay, I agree. You just put them on a Christian. What it's was my conclusion? Problem. What was my conclusion? That it's belief no, not you to... Say that, you say it's, that. So, it's good not to believe Jesus. Okay. Yeah, because it's you said different, different things. things. No problem. Can I, can I show you why it's not different things? It's good. I'll tell you if you allow me just to explain why it's not different things. It's good to believe whatever you want. Believing whatever I want, including not believing in Jesus Christ, which equals it is good not to believe in Jesus Christ. It's basic, basic logic here. I'm not using no, any, no, any, no, no. any, any why? That is your conclusion. Why? Not just Jesus Christ. Okay. It's good. The good thing is the act that people have right to believe whatever they want whatever to believe. They want. They believe. We don't so have a problem with that. We can, exclude, we can exclude the object. No, but it doesn't I'm mean it's talking, good. I'm not talking mm. about if Jesus it is Jesus, Christian. if it is Krishna, if it is Allah, if it is Tuhan in Indonesia. Mm -hmm. So the act of believing, no matter what the object of your belief, mm -hmm. it's, it's good. good. Because it's it people's okay right. Now, now that's a different statement, right? Okay, and good. It's the, people's right okay, to sure, have their sure. own belief. Now, now you're saying, yeah. You're saying a different statement now, which you're saying what is good is the, the capacity to be able to believe what you want to be, yeah. freedom to believe, right? Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. what you're saying now, yeah? yeah? So that is different than saying it's good to believe whatever you want. Like linguistically, it's not the same thing, right? If you say it's good to believe whatever you want, that means it's good to believe you can murder, kill, steal and rape. But if you say, if you say it's good to have the freedom of believing, then we don't have a, we're not, we're not disagreeing with you there, right? We're saying it is good, people should have the freedom. In the context of religion, right? Of course. Yes. You're jumping Absolutely. Conclusion. No problem. I believe. I sometimes, yeah, there's no problem, no worries. Sometimes I have this mistake, I can yeah. jump conclusion. No you I can believe, correct me, it's okay. I believe in religion. Yes. As much as I believe I'm being serious, in by the way. You should be laughing. Yeah. Who's laughing? Yeah. yeah. No, no. Mm. I believe in religion mm. as much as I believe in humanity. Mm. Whatever their religion. No. In humanity, mm. we know that murder, stealing, it's bad. Don't do that. Whatever is religion. Is that a question to me? No. That I, is my statement. Oh, sure. That is my statement. I would disagree a little bit with it. Because there was many humans throughout history who didn't and believe then, that. And then, the religion make it formal, make it uh, the rule, make it straight, mm. that is forbidden and it will going, you will go to hell if you do something like that. But you believe, if you believe in human, mm -hmm. even atheist doesn't believe the murder. Okay, sure. Even atheist doesn't steal. Sure. I, I want to I want to conclude with this. Maybe you want to continue with him as well. My conclusion but, is, okay, your conclusion, I believe, okay. I believe in religion mm -hmm. as much as I believe in humanity. Okay. And I believe that religion, whatever it is, come to earth, like we know now, your religion, your religion, to serve, to be served the human being, mm -hmm. not human to serve the religion. Okay, so, no problem, thank you very much. Now, what I would, what I would say just briefly is this, what you've just proposed to us right now is what we call liberalism, it's not Christianity, and it is the idea of the freedom to do whatever you want as long as you don't harm anyone else. What you're proposing to us here 
so I would not say I'm having a discussion with a Christian. I would say I'm having a discussion with a liberal, because what you're saying is liberalism. If you just allow me, sorry, just allow, to allow the final statement, you can come with a final statement, but just allow me just. Oh, it's oh yeah, 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 because I need to go. I need to go. I need to go. Yes, no, because because you guys told me what you believe because of faith. So to me, that's the end, because anyone can believe anything because of faith. If there's no substance to the discussion. If I, if you say to me, oh, you're Muslim because of faith, the discussion is gone. You know, I can go home now. You know, so by, to me, to me, yeah, to me, that's what I'm trying to. That's why I say I'm, I'm giving my final statement. Yeah. So to me, you are proposing liberalism. If you read uh, in the Christian scripture, it's, uh, Paul says there's no salvation without the belief in the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ. There's a lake of fire in the Bible if you don't believe in Jesus Christ that you're going to go to. So it's not only Muslims or this religion or that religion that says you're going to go to the fire. Christianity, if you read the Bible, says the exact same thing. Claims there's only one way to God, but you're proposing liberalism, not Christianity. Now, in Islam, we say there's only one truth. Allah Azza says in the Quran, whoever seeks any other religion other than Islam, it will not be accepted from him. Okay. And he will be amongst the losers in the hereafter. Okay. We invite you to worship one creator who's not a man, who's not a woman, who doesn't become the creation, who's not the creation before, who created this world, who's given us the capacity to reason and have rational, polite, hopefully, conversation between one another without having any enmity towards each other, you know? And I hope I didn't offend you guys in no, any way, shape or form. That was not my my, my intention. I was not trying to, uh, to do so. Yes. The last time. Last the second last statement. Okay, no, that's okay, no problem. Okay, yeah. You have very thin border between Christian and liberalism. There is, you're saying there is a thin border between Christianity you, you, and liberalism. You make it very thin. I made them thin. I will let people de decide. I'll let people decide. Final statement. Oh, it's okay. No problem. It's okay. It's okay. Pleasure to talk you in both of you. you Maybe he wants to continue you the discussion. Know, so they got, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. Yeah, yeah. From liberalists. Yes. Liberalists, right? Yes. No, no problem. That is, that no problem. No, pro no, no issues. As I said before, liberalism is the freedom to believe whatever you want to believe. It's good to believe whatever you want to believe. And that's what you were proposing. And Christianity proposes something else in the Bible. Yes, absolutely. So nice talking to you guys, yeah? Pleasure talking to both of you, yeah? 